Hello guys and welcome back to Final Fantasy. Do I have to say anything? Really? Do I have to say it? The two of you here for the audition? Second floor, at the very end of the walk. And don't go poking your nose in where it doesn't belong. Welcome to the mansion of the esteemed Don Corneo. Nothing there, nothing I can take. That one's okay. Madame M's girl, ain't it? Man, she's hot. Hey, hands to yourself. I'm sorry. I was... thought we were going this way. That Andrea's girl? I'd let her do things to me. Go to your room and wait. Quietly. Okay. Room's at the end. Keep walking. I've got to say it. If you can't love yourself, how the hell are you gonna love anybody else? Can I get an amen up in here? Amen. Shante, you stay. Now, sashay away. A <laughs> uh, little bit of RuPaul's Drag Race. Gotta love it. Sweet smell. Then why do I feel so dizzy? Gas. Uh, uh. Come on. <laughs> Damn it. Cloud. Oh, uh, 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 no. <laughs> How are you pretty ladies doing? Feeling a little lightheaded, but we can't have that. Let's say we escort you to the parlor so you can make yourself more comfortable. Let's get this show on the road. Where are you taking us? Come on now, Nancy Daisy. Hey, what do you care, asshole? The hell? You want to throw down the Corneo's girl? So if you leave a mark on him, you ain't getting off with a horn. I know. Managed to wrangle some real lookers this time, though. <laughs> you know what, <I'm> saying? <laughs> what the hell? Hey, can you hear me? <clears throat> Tifa? Yes? You okay? Mm hmm. <sighs> Good. Wait a minute. Oh my god. <gasps> Cloud? Is that you? Oh my god, that makeup! And that dress! Nailed it, I know, thank you. Moving on. <laughs> yeah, Liz, can we quickly get past that the fact that I've been put in drag? You good? Yeah, bit woozy, but I'll manage. <sighs> hey, Tifa, how you doing? Uh, okay. Oh, right. I'm Aerith, a friend of Cloud's. We were worried and thought we'd come help you out. Uh, thanks? Cut the chatter. We gotta leave. Huh? Right now. No! Not until I got what I came for. What? So, after we made it back to the slums, some guys came around asking all kinds of questions. Hmm. So I did some digging. And found out they were Corneo's men. Right. They were interested in Avalanche. But I couldn't figure out why. So I thought I'd come and ask the man himself. Seriously? thought if I could find a way in and get some one-on-one -on -one time, but then I realized I'd only be one of three candidates, and that if he didn't pick me, it would all be for nothing. Then your worries are over, aren't they? Because the other two candidates are right here, right? <laughs> oh, God. Right. So yeah, if we're all in on it, then nothing can go wrong. Uh, I guess not. You? Me? Cloud? Makes no difference who gets chosen, does it? I don't know, Aerith. It feels wrong getting you involved in all this. Don't even bother trying to talk her out of it. Oh, Cloud, 
gets me. Took you long enough. So what happened? Right. I better do Tifa's. Give me a minute. Call for us <clears throat> when it's time. This room gives me the creeps. All done. I've sorted everything out. Tonight's audition's about to begin. Head out the door to the left and up the stairs. Come on, ladies. Let's hustle. All right, guys. Let's do this. <laughs> do you want to do this? Oh, God. I just... Uh... Beautiful ladies, time to line up for the dawn. <sighs> hmm. Hmm? Wait, you look kind of familiar. We haven't met before, have we? Mm -mm. <sighs> uh, whatever. <laughs> All right, y'all good to go. Close. Then let's do this thing. Introducing Walmart's most eligible bachelor, the one and only Da Corneo. Ladies? Uh. Oh, God, look at him. Nice. Very nice. <laughs> Whichever one shall I pick? Mm. Oh. Shall I pick you? <laughs> or maybe you? Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be me. <laughs> oh yeah! I've got it! I've got it! Today's bride to be is... Today's? And tomorrow's, or the day after's, if the dawn takes a shine to you. Pathetic. Huh? Hey, which one of you said that? Was it you? Ooh, you got a mouth on you! I'm gonna enjoy breaking it in. Today's lucky lady is the big bone girl. <laughs> Still playing hard to get? I can dig it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, I called it. Leftovers are all yours. Yeah, yeah we! Okay. <laughs> okay, ladies. Y'all coming with me. <laughs> oh, God. Don't be shy, little kitten. Shimmy on over and give daddy some sugar. No need to play coy. Nobody here but you and me. Oh, you're even cuter than I thought. Back off. Ooh! <laughs> this kitten's got claws! I love it! <laughs> His belly jiggles. What was that? 
Don't you worry, your pretty little head. Just a picture to preserve the moment. And to ensure you don't do anything inappropriate like say no. Asshole. Oh, phrase me more! <laughs> hey, yo, fellas! We got guests, and y'all got first crack at entertaining them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> Courtesy of the ever-generous Don Corneo himself, never forget, the Don provides. Yeah. So, ladies, ready to get to it? Yeah. I guess I'm good to go whenever. How about you, Tifa? Mm. Four guys between us. Okay, let's not keep Cloud waiting. Right. Wait. I know you. The Coliseum! <laughs> what the hell? Get down! <laughs> <laughs> Don't you stupid! Wait! <laughs> Good job, Aerith! It was nothing compared to you! <laughs> Go, power! <sighs> Andrea filled me in on the situation. I come bearing gifts, your gear. I'll do what ah. I can to clean this up. Just finish the job. Uh, thank you! His man on the inside. There we go. All of them come for Okay, me again. let's go rescue Cloud. Corneo's room, right? Better hurry. Better hurry. Okay, nothing else. Man, I'd love to spend some quality time in a curve like that. Bet they're going at it right now. This one's for you! To be honest, Aerith is like. Huh? Go on. Ready to whoop ass. This one's free. Yeah. yeah, I got that. Hey. Take a knife. Gotcha. Here it comes. That's the way to do it. Ah, oh, so that's. What you a bad boy bastard. I am! <laughs> yes, yes I am! Here I come, baby! <laughs> <laughs> hey, who the hell gave you permission to do that? One of you get in here and teach this bitch some manners! <sighs> Sorry, but your boys had to learn some manners too. What the? Cloud, your clothes! <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> so you're a man, huh? What are you three up to? We'll ask the questions. Like, why'd you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? <sighs> huh? Don't know what you're talking about. Don't play dumb with me. Let's try again. Why did you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? Spill the beans, or... I'll cut them off. All right, all right! I'll <laughs> talk, I'll talk! <sighs> uh, 
Uh, some guy with a gun for an arm. I was paid to find him. Paid by who? I can't tell you that. They'd hunt me down like a dog. Well, you better. Because if you don't, I'll rip them off. <laughs> it was the director of public security, Heidegger. It was Heidegger. Shinra. And what were they planning? Some things are better left unsaid, you know? See, I'm not so sure they are. Better keep talking. <laughs> or I'll smash them. <laughs> All right, you got me. I could never say no to a sexy girl. Since Avalanche blew up two reactors, mm. Shinra's decided they ought to stamp them out, home base and all. And I mean, stamp out. By targeting the support pillar and blowing it up. The pillar? Did I stutter? The plate will come crushing down. It'll be Sector 6 all over again. I'm sure you've been there and mm. seen the wreckage for yourself. So you know exactly what Sector 7's gonna look like. They wouldn't. Come on, guys. We gotta go. Before you do... No. Please, this won't take long. As everyone knows, villains only divulge their plans in a certain situation. But what is that situation? Hmm. Hmm? <laughs> when they think they've already won, right? Ladies and gentlemen, we have ourselves a winner! I've watched too many superhero stuff you to get know an that. All expenses paid trip to the sewers. <laughs> 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 Enjoy the sights and smells! <laughs>
I saved her. She saved me. Round and round it goes. And that's all there is to it. Sure there isn't something else going on? Mm. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Something's just woken up. Big. What the fuck is that? We may have a slight problem again. The music is copyrighted, so I've got to put this in again to let you know it's copyrighted. And it's a fucking pain in my ass, cause I've got to edit it all out there and put this in. So yeah, it's all copyrighted. The music's copyrighted. Um, let the battle begin, I think it's called. And yeah, that soundtrack is copyrighted, so I've got to edit this all out. Uh, but it was such a good fight, I didn't want to cut it at all. But, sadly, you don't get to see it. So you just get me talking to you right now. And singing! But yes, so... I hope you enjoy the last little le end bit of the episode and enjoy and please be knowledgeable and watch out for more copyright stuff in my videos when more stuff go wrong. Okay, back to your regularly scheduled program. Do you think it lives down here or? It was probably, probably Cornelius' does. pet. And we were dinner. <laughs> hey. <laughs> You don't believe that crazy story of his, do you? Shinra wouldn't sacrifice a whole sector just to take out Avalanche, would they? Destroying part of the city, killing all those people just to get at us? I don't know. Is Corneo the kind of guy who'd make up shit just to screw with you? I wouldn't put it past him. But if he was telling the truth, hmm? and there's still a chance he was, isn't there, then we should yeah. go. We need to get going. And if now. it turns out he was lying, then so what? Right? Mm. Hmm? Uh, uh, Tifa! Right, I am gonna end I mean, the video here, guys. These tunnels are all connected. Shut up, Tifa! I'm gonna end the video here, guys. My name's BK Fursey. Thank you so much for watching. Hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, and hit that bell for more notifications when I upload another video. And please, be knowledgeable. See you guys. It stinks. It really stinks.